Hey everyone, welcome to Tech in 5 Minutes. Are you choosing between Spark and Hadoop for your development project? We have tested and analyzed both services to determine their differences and similarities. Everything you need to know about these big data tools is here. So what is Hadoop? Hadoop is a big data framework that stores and processes big data in clusters. This software is based on MapReduce, a programming model that processes multiple data nodes simultaneously. Key features of Hadoop. Fault tolerance. Hadoop replicates each data node automatically. Even if one cluster is down, the entire structure remains unaffected. Name nodes. Hadoop always runs active nodes that step in if some become inactive due to technical errors. Built-in modules. Hadoop offers Yarn, a framework for cluster management, distributed file system for increased efficiency, and Hadoop Ozone for saving objects. And what is Spark? Spark is the framework written in Scala that organizes information in clusters. The system consists of core functionality and extensions. Spark SQL, streaming for real-time data, MLib for machine learning, and others. Apache Spark is faster than Hadoop, and that always means better. Don't you think so? The code on the frameworks is written with 80 high-level operators. These additional levels of abstraction allow reducing the number of code lines. Key features of Spark. The system can be integrated with many popular computing systems and databases. The application supports other Apache clusters or works as a standalone application. In case you'd like to learn more about their features and other big data tools, Check out the link in the description box. Let's now compare Hadoop and Spark. Architecture. Hadoop and Spark approach data processing in slightly different ways. At first, the files are processed in a Hadoop distributed file system. This is where the data is split into blocks. Each cluster undergoes replication in case the original file fails or is mistakenly deleted. Hadoop architecture integrated a MapReduce algorithm to allocate computing resources. The results are reported back to HDFS, where new data blocks will be split in an optimized way. In Spark architecture, all the computations are carried out in memory. Data allocation also starts from HFDS, but goes to the resilient distributed data set. The data here is processed in parallel, continuously. This obviously contributed to better performance speed. Performance. Based on our experience, Spark is better for smaller but faster apps, whereas Hadoop is chosen for projects where ability and reliability are the key requirements. Languages. Spark is a lot more versatile. However, if you are considering a Java-based project, Hadoop might be a better fit because it's the tool's native language. Cost. Both tools are available open source, so they are technically free. Still, there are associated expenses to consider. Overall, Hadoop is cheaper in the long run. Spark, on the other hand, has a better quality and price ratio. Security. Both Spark and Hadoop have similar security options, and you can configure them based on your project needs. We recommend taking into account that security in Spark is off by default. This could mean you are vulnerable to attack by default. Compatibility. Both tools are mainly compatible with Python, R, Java, and Scala and some others. Hadoop generally supports more languages. Additionally, Spark and Hadoop are compatible with each other. Spark integrates Hadoop core components like Yarn and HDFS. Usability. We think Spark is more user-friendly because it comes together with multiple APIs. Developers can install native extensions in the language of their project to manage code, organize data, work with SQL databases, Hadoop also supports add-ons, but the choice is more limited, and APIs are less intuitive. Is it the most important factor when it comes to choosing between Spark and Hadoop? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Which companies use Hadoop? Hadoop is perfect for large networks of enterprises, scientific computations, and predictive platforms such as Amazon, Cloudera, IBM, Microsoft, and even Switzerland-based Large Hadron Collider. Which companies use Spark? Spark is essential for companies that are handling huge amounts of big data in real time. This software is used for machine learning, personalization, real-time marketing campaigns such as TripAdvisor and Alibaba Taobao. Keep in mind that you don't have to choose between the two tools if you want to benefit from the advantages of both. For every Hadoop version, 
there's a possibility to integrate Spark into the tech stack. And that's all. This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. We are a software development company providing engineering, UI UX design, testing, and IT consulting services. Find our contact details in the description box. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the like button.